Okay, so now we have our flight. Uh, we currently have it as unlimited fuel, so just to show you some uh, extra stuff there. We're flying from the Auckland International Airport. What we do in this case is we'll be starting up from a dark, cold, dark start. If we check from the outside, you'll see some cool on live of Auckland International Airport. What we do is we just start up some basic stuff. So with the checklist I have, we've got the pre-start checklist. So parking brake is set. We've got the chocks are removed. GPU is connected. Throttles are idle and they're off. Master engines are off. We want the batteries on. So we can click here, battery one, battery two. This will activate the radios. Auckland clearance delivery for New Zealand, 6143, heavy IFR, to Wellington, ready to copy. New Zealand, 6143, heavy, is cleared to Wellington Airport and filed. Take off runway, two tree left climb and maintain 11,000 feet. Departure frequency is 119er, death all 2 squawk, 0231. Air New Zealand 6143, heavy clear to Wellington Airport, <coughs> Excuse me, so what I'll do here is now just do some basic Departure stuff, so let's connect the air bridge. Air New Zealand 6143, heavy readback, correct. Contact ground on 123, decimal zero. Good day. So what we can do is get everything all prepared, so what we can do is just do ground services. Let's get the passengers on board. Request the passengers. Auckland Rounder, New Zealand, 6143 Heavy. Could you please connect the jetway to the aircraft? During this time, what I would do is get the pre flight New stuff New Zealand, done. 6143 Heavy. The jetway is going to be connected. Put the winter lights on, the logo on. Put the uh, runway lights and stuff after. It's all connected. As you see, Auckland it's getting close. New Zealand, 453, requesting pushback. Yet, I don't want to push back yet. New Zealand 453 pushback request accepted. So, as you see the connecting, let's load the passengers. The warning thing here. Ready. New Zealand 453 with Oscar ready to taxi IFR. What I'll do now is um, let's get everything prepared. New Zealand 453 passengers are now boarding. Short runway, two tree left, using taxiway Alpha. Contact tower on 120 decimal 905 when ready. During that time, we'll get everything ready. So basically, what we're going to do is put on everything. Uh, smoking. Taxi takes a lot on. So what we do now is get everything ready. Using taxiway Alpha, New Zealand 453. Turn everything on. Get everything ready. Here, everyone, let's close the doors. Hello, everyone. Captain and the entire crew would like to welcome you aboard on this aircraft. Alpha Ground Generic Alpha Papa Kilo 73 requesting pushback. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. Alpha Ground Generic Alpha Papa Kilo 73 pushback. Come back to the captain, your first officer, and your paper crew. I'd like to welcome you aboard this evening. Jetway just get it. Proud to be part of the Star Alliance network. The Navy is the world wide organization to be the world for safety and the kids and staff the aircraft, as well as the instructions of your crew. Please assist the cabin crew in preparing for departure by placing your carry luggage either while underneath the seat in front of you or in the overhead lockers above. Please ensure your seat box are fastened, keep the box are upright, and you can have your equipment stowed away. What we do now is uh, continue the rest of the items. What you can do is you can either do a manual or a manual. You can 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 do Right, let's get underway. Flight attendant, arm your doors. Hello everyone, the doors are now closed. Any portable electronic devices, such as any features, like a laptop, any cameras, no cameras, no shop. 
Again, the mobile phone will be yeah, and the the flat motor the flaps at 10 degrees. So you see the flaps going down. I'll do 15 actually. Oh, I'll do 15.
aircraft in the way. Sometimes the air traffic control will tell you otherwise and then people just have to either acknowledge it or go in front of the other aircraft. Set to 15, I'm going to put them up 110 degrees. Perhaps it's 10 degrees and quiet. Ladies and gentlemen, due to COVID-19, we would like to remind passengers that you have to wear a face mask at all times during this flight. If you require a new face mask, please ask one of our crew members for one. Thank you. So we've got another aircraft in front. We will wait behind. You see how many other aircrafts you can see these. New Zealand A226, which looks like it's going to be taking off. And we should have another couple in front. Perhaps merge, not three. So we see one other aircraft is now about to roll out. There's another Air New Zealand A226, and as you see, they'll be. Oh, we've got another one there, it's just arrived as well. Another Airbus, and that was coming from Wellington, into WN, it's just arrived here. evening here at Auckland International Airport as you can see. A lot of players flying this evening. I've got the settings for flight sim as live, so where the conditions are live is what we currently have here in Auckland.
make sure that the Cape Pilot does stop. Okay, two to see two outwards. Authorization to take off. Runway two tree left or New Zealand six one four three. Here for our radar, just past our double lines here. Put up to four one hundred percent maximum power, and now we'll go and uh, enjoy the ride to Wellington.
Infantry Heavy Contact, New Zealand Center, on 119er, Death All 2. Good day. 119er Decimal 2 for New Zealand 6143 Heavy. New Zealand Center or New Zealand 6143 Heavy is passing 1,000 feet, climbing 11,000 feet. Air New Zealand 6143 Heavy, New Zealand Center Altimeter Tree 0, Decimal Tree 0, continue to brook as planned. Come 10,000 feet, we'll be able to turn off the landing lights, standard, as the uh, checklist uh, after flight departure is done, and now we'll be turning them off. Done, so usually 10,000 feet, landing lights and taxi lights of the aircraft are turned off.
climb and maintain flight level 240 or New Zealand 6143 heavy. What we'll do now is we'll initiate the automatic pilot. Um, the rest requests us to go to 24,000 feet. So 24,000 feet and we'll be done. AP 24,000 feet. Set up. You will attack.
above your assigned altitude. Descend and maintain flight level 240. Descend and maintain flight level 240 or New Zealand 6143 heavy.
Disneyland 614 tree. Heavy, please expedite your descent flight level 240.
43. Heavy, please expedite your descent flight level 240. to descend to 15,000 feet so we'll head it down to 15,000 feet now and what do we 
do is I'll put a little landmark in here so you can see where Wellington is. Only 74.48 nautical miles left to go. Landing lights are on. Now we're going down to 15,000 feet and we'll prepare to get everything ready. Currently 66.73 nautical miles out from Wellington. We may actually uh, do an automatic pilot landing, catching the ILS. Flight to drone. We get closer, we shall land using the autopilot. that um, my flight from the 2020 has is quite a few cool camera angles that you can see and as I go through them all you see various uh, in-flight camera views so we have one here from the cabin and then to go through we have on the other side which is pretty pretty decent view compared to uh, the old days of Microsoft Flight Sim Head back to the cockpit. And uh, we prepare now to go lower from 15,000 to 116,700 feet. Uh, we have 50.70 uh, miles from Wellington. We'll start the rest of the aircraft now and for one thing we'd have to do the old announcement for the cabin crew to prepare all passengers to land so we'll get it ready now and we'll just get one to the seat buttons on <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we ask air passengers to please remain seated with your seatbelts fastened. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, in preparation for landing, please make sure all electronic devices are now switched off. Your seatbelts are securely fastened and your seatbacks and tray tables are in the upright and locked positions. If you've had any carrying luggage out during the flight, now is the time to make sure it is securely stowed, either well underneath the seat in front of you or in the overhead lockers above. Once again, if you are in one of our exit rows today, please make sure all carrying luggage is stowed in the overhead lockers only. Once again, if you do have any questions or you need any assistance, feel free to ask the cabin crew. They'll be more than happy to help you. Cabin crew, prepare cabin for arrival, please.
dummy now, 38 nautical miles from Wellington, as you see in the... Yeah, we still going down for 15,000 feet, yes we will. What we're doing here is we've uh, put the brakes on to Maintain medium. present heading at altitude. Expect ILS runway 16 approach via Whiskey November 9 or 9 or radial 15 DME arc. Clear to Whiskey November or New Zealand 6143 heavy. Over speed. too fast, so. Over speed. Over speed. Over speed. Over speed. Decrease the throttles because I'm going to get the under 360. Landing speed. Will be two hundred knots, so we're going to decrease our speed. So now we've kind of put all the throttles back. Speed brakes I won't do it quite yet. I'll be putting on the flaps as we get closer. So as you see from the map. Cross sharp turn, reverse back, and. Heavy, please expedite your descent 15,000 feet. One thing which is strange of Rucksoft is a lot of the time they will actually not properly have the air traffic control in sync with the game. So you could be at 15,000 feet and tells you to expedite or, or climb. Is we just decrease more, even though we haven't got commands, but I think we'll just go down to a little bit lower. Are we doing a an AP approach? do here is I'll go against air traffic controls orders and just go a little bit of a, a lower altitude a sec slowly creep down but what I'll do also is I'll start to put on some flaps uh, just to slow the aircraft down we're going quite fast so to the flaps one change it now we have to go around so we aren't lined up for the AS so we'll tend to do a bit of a circuit I think we're quite high too that's pretty manageable Ladies and gentlemen, due to COVID-19, we would like to remind passengers that you have to wear a face mask at all times during this flight. If you require a new face mask, 
Please ask one of our crew members for one. Thank you. Some uh, air traffic there, the New Zealand 5827, it's high over there. And as we do a, a, bar, a, a bit of an arc back to the right, we appear to line up. Now down to uh, 5,000 feet, and uh, we see some sharp turns and some banks and circles just to decrease our height, and then be in preparation to catch the glide scope and the ILS into Wellington Airport.
can't correct the ourselves and we've got our required waypoints. We're now on par to enter our glide scope as we get closer to our final approach. Set the uh, the uh, autopilot to to take us in towards the airport, and I'll try to set the RS approach. I'll now set the uh, flaps to ten. Slow down our descent. Two thousand five hundred. Set the auto throttle up. Just stop any. Stools. And the gear will go down very shortly. I will put full flaps on as we approach closer. Come in 10. What I do now is actually put another flap down to Welcome 15. To New Zealand 5386 is passing 9800 feet, descending 5000 feet. Can you have the same? New Zealand 
flaps 15 degrees descending down get closer we'll get the glide slope Company 184 knots, 185, that's good. We bank to our left, come on to a final approach. Descend further. Runway 16 Air New Zealand 
comes on because we're only get under 140 and we only get stool. Air brakes are on. Full flaps. New Zealand flight A27. Follow the Airbus A20N on final. Wind 027 at 5. Clear to land runway 16. Everything's all set up now. And the Clear feet. to land runway 16. New Zealand flight A27. Everything's looking good. off the auto thrust, I don't want to get too high. You can just see it perfectly now. Uh, thrust down, we don't want to auto thrust up, we want it down. Up. Get brakes off. Let's retract the flaps. Flaps being retracted. Let's go to the gate. Ladies and gentlemen, please remain seated with your seatbelt securely fastened until the aircraft has come to complete stop. One one eight decimal eight, your New Zealand six one four three heavy. When preparing to disembark, please remember to take all personal belongings with you. Wellington Ground, your New Zealand six one four three heavy taxi to the gate. If your cell phone or other electronic devices are on, please remain seated. Your New Zealand six one four three heavy taxi to the gate. Taxi to gate two one via taxiway or New Zealand six one four three heavy. Turning off landing lights. Keep on the taxi light. One two one decimal one New Zealand five eight two seven. Wellington Domestic and International Airport here in New Zealand. Here's our gate.
our approach our gate. Center. Right next to a Linda aircraft. thing we have here you can choose on your options to put as many many public areas and airport vehicles and people that you want. I've got mine hundred percent meaning that there's a lot of ground utility. Just, as you can see there's some stuff behind things going in front it's quite busy. Go forward, and then basically that should be the end of our flight. And we will break right on the dot. Engine stop. Welcome to Wellington. And that is flying from Auckland International Airport to Wellington. You can do the usual stray wolf, beacon off, wings off, leave the nav on, icing off. Lights off, strobe off, nav off, beacon off, pump off, the ice off, pilot heat off, brake is on. The last thing we need to do now is Turn the battery off. There we go, that was 56 minutes flight time from Auckland to Wellington. So stay tuned for more exciting flights. And we shall see you again.